Welcome back fam, thank you for still being here and thank you for witnessing maybe major turn in the altcoins market. Today we are talking about altcoins, altcoin season, everything related to altcoins on the daily chart in the short term. For the big question, is the altcoin season upon us? From the short term perspective of course. Because you want to know what's happening in the next couple of days in this video long-term prediction another video okay what you're seeing on the screen is an altcoin market cap with current valuation of 891 billion dollars now in october when we started this journey we were at about of 500 and something approximately 520 billion dollars and we have a nice impulsive move very very nice now let's talk about this in my book and opinion altcoins were moving from that point in October in a parallel channel to the upside. You can see it clearly. Support, resistance, multiple touches of support and here at the beginning of this year a breakdown. After the breakdown we had even a retest pushing us into even a higher high than this one at around 880 billion dollars. So practically around the levels that we are recording this video of course this was the case of that we made a retracement now if you follow my videos and you know that i'm being pretty bearish still thinking that this wasn't enough could i have been wrong absolutely i could but in my opinion this was not enough now at this point as the days passed after this move it could be enough that's why i'm saying always use your own head this is just my perspective and I thought they were going even lower. That is still not out of the gates. I will show you scenarios why and how, but we gotta take the perspective of a flop into some bullish narrative from these points. And we will talk about that and give you the final reason why altcoin season really could be upon us. So this was our proof, proof that impulsive move was moving in a parallel channel broken like this to the downside new trend was formed and here we moved out of the downtrend into something completely new could we expect new highs well yes we could because we are now in a totally different narrative here and here this is an uncharted territory now you can see how strategy this look almost 100 billion dollars was injected in the last well i would say week so can we get a retracement? Yes, we could. But we also could get one more push to the upside and then retracement into this area, which I will show you now. Now, one more zoom in for the detailed explanation of that support level that you should be watching. Now, this is the level I am referring to, $860 billion. That's right, $860 billion. So let's talk about this level because it has a big significance for the future of altcoin market and the ignition of altcoin season. Why that level? Because it was a resistance in Christmas time. One touch, two touches. It was a resistance in January of this year, two times, just like in December. But here, now this is a good timing of making this video because here, just a few days ago, we broke out of it with a full body candle, which is excellent sign. Here we broke out of it, but never got, well, let's say, living above it. Next candle was super bearish. This is not showing signs of stopping. And this, at this moment, is not showing signs of bearishness. We gotta be honest. And yes, I still think there is some slight chance of possibility of whatever I said in those few videos when I was bearish and gave you those lower targets. You never know what Black Swan event could be coming, but we gotta state the fact $860, billions of course, is now an important support. Ladies and gentlemen, if we can hold 860 as the grand support, not fumbling below it, now that would be a rare scenario, and that would reach us into some lower targets, we are going higher into the uncharted territory and mark my words in the coming days or possible weeks breaking one trillion market cap of altcoin market alone i will show you the proof of what i'm speaking soon 
So watch this level 860, let it hold, because no one knows when the retracement is coming. But if we presume in the coming days, I want this level to hold before going into the new uncharted territory above one trillion dollar. Now let's talk about why one trillion dollar. Okay, zoomed out again for the clear calculation and using my Fibonacci for the target that I'm about to give you. What am I talking about? And this, ladies and gentlemen, we use this high from January and this February low to create a new target to the upside of 161.8% retracement of all the altcoins combined. So here it goes. If we can hold first 860 and then of course this high that we measured and the high was 885 billion dollars, we are going above 1 trillion right into 1 trillion and 3. So if we can hold this level that I just talked about, practically the whole video, 885, those 860, that region, we're going into $1 trillion of only altcoins, not Bitcoin. Altcoins will pass $1 trillion. Now, is that alt season here and could we see higher targets? Ladies and gentlemen, let me present you something. What you are seeing on the screen is multiple moving averages creating one big huge S band. And the moving averages are ranging on from 21, 34, 55, 89, 144, 233. The point of this band is to show you that for the real altcoin season to align, we need to have the perfect alignment of moving averages for the clear uptrend. Of course, smaller should be on the upside, those lower ones should be on the downside. So we should have what we had here, one, two, three, four, five, six alignments perfectly. Now, what is not a perfect alignment, it's something like this, but something like this is perfection. So we should have that perfect alignment like here, not something like here. What's happening today? How are those moving averages aligned today? Let's call it one way, perfection, bigger, Smaller, 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 smallest. Pointing to the upside, ladies and gentlemen. The band is showing us upside potential that is gonna happen in the coming days. Of course, with a possible retracement. Because you can see the 21 exponential moving average. Oh yeah, if I forgot to mention, this band is made of exponential moving averages. It's standing at 836 at this moment. Now, moving averages will move to the upside, they are not static, they are dynamic support. At some point from that 836, we could go into that 860 that we discussed here, making it a grand support for the new move to the upside. But as you can see with today's candles, we are already moving above 900 billion, and the market is above the supportive zone and kind of bullish. But is now the real deal about getting into the altcoins? Not really, generally. Yes, you can see everything aligned pretty nicely, but I would wait for a retracement into that supportive zone. And the retracement I'm talking about, it's something like this. You can see the touch and continuation and this and this, something like that, until we see some problems like this area. For now, a retracement into the lower regions is possible, but would be a great buying opportunity for the outcome season. Is this the real deal outcome season? At this point, we don't know, but we know that short term we do have a momentum. Can it grow into the big outcome season from this mini daily chart outcome season? Yes, it can, but I wouldn't go that far for now. You are having your targets. And you are having the final conclusion, altcoins are bullish. But with a possible retracement of a merely $40 billion. Hey, if you can endure it, go ahead, pick your favorite stuff and Geronimo into the rule.